not one, not two, but three bars of soap has subscribed with the Twitch Prime over on twitch.tv slash Brian Saviano. Thank you for doing that. Greatly appreciated, sir. And everyone else, hello. Including Wood643, Cullen Ransom, Uncle Bricky, Tanya Castro, London Montgomery, Caleb, and everyone else. C.W. Perkins, Ileana, ooh, hello. Do I have something from you? I think I do. I thought I did. I thought I saw something. My Tuesday is going well. Yes, I see one from Miss Ileana here. Hmm. Okay. Loopy Show, hello. Samuel, hello. Everybody, hello. Let's just, let's just get this thing over with. Or not over with. Get on with it. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Brian Saviano, a.k.a. Lincoln Log Larry, the number one Super Smash Bros. player within a 15-foot radius of where I'm sitting right now. Uh, everyone who's over uh, watching the live stream, hello. Why am I way back here? C keep it spicy. You know what I mean? I want to be immersed in the purple and the darkness and the in the whatever here. All right? That's how it's going to go. So hopefully your Tuesday is going well. My Tuesday is going tremendously. I'm not looking dapper. It's Well, actually, looking dapper in that Bricks O'Brien merchandise, baby. That's what I'm looking dapper in right here. That's what's going to get all the ladies here. Anyway, so, I mean, actually... Not actually. I wasn't going anywhere with that. Uh, what I meant to say, over on the shop, new things have been updated. Uh, designs have been updated. So the one, you know, so you see like the background here, like with the, the moon and the stars and the skyline and whatnot. I have updated the skyline and whatnot to be more reflective of uh, what is newer for me. And that's going to be going into the new decade. 2020 is coming up soon, ladies and gentlemen. So if you haven't gotten any sort of merch so far, uh, now's a good time to do it because it's been uh, newly updated, uh, including the Leviathan variant as well as Super Bricks O'Brien and the standard design. New mug and all that sort of stuff too. So, uh, but that's not why you're here, all right? Uh, you are here because you want to see me open some fan mail. And it feels weird for me to call it fan mail. It feels weird to call you like my fans. Just seems a little weird. I don't know, man. I don't know. It just, it just, I don't know. So whatever. I have mail that has been sent to the P.O. Box. The P.O. Box is as follows up here. Click and, nope, that's the wrong thing. I click and drag. Oops, hold on. Here we go. Right there. 321 Main Street, number 1448. Wakefield, Massachusetts, 01880. Please type or put that address on the uh, address line as exactly as you see it right here. That's going to be your best bet to uh, get some mail over to me as it is greatly appreciated. And if you don't want to, you don't have to, man. Don't send me things. Do not send me things. Letters, drawings, pictures. Do not send me things. It looks like um, uh, Ben... Has not followed that because he sent me a package here. But anyways, um, we're going to where W R E you going to play Luigi's Mansion three. That is actually the thing I wanted to talk about also. So the official game plan is Luigi's Mansion three will be played. The day comes out Thursday. I'm going to start my live stream at one. I'm going to be recording for my video series as well as live streaming it. So similar to how you've seen Undertale before it. Uh, I will switch from being recording and then to interacting with the chat. That way, uh, when you see the video series go up on YouTube and all those other places, it all looks like one cohesive piece right there. So that's going to be the deal. And uh, hopefully you'll be there to uh, join me. I'll be eating candy. I'll be in costume. I'll be in all sorts of other stuff. But that's going to happen Thursday at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. That'll be my streaming day for Thursday. So I'm not going to stream at 1 and then 7. I'll just do 1 o'clock. And basically, I'm going to go until I'm exhausted, which I don't know how long that'll be. A couple hours probably. We'll see. The kids are pumped for the stream. Well, I'm pumped to play Luigi's Mansion 3, man. It's going to be good. It's going to be fantastic, hopefully. Uh, no, it, it totally will be. Uh, it'll it'll go on until whenever, but then you can watch the video afterward if you want to. You can do whatever else. So, um, Pooh Bear, hello. Uh, you know? So, if you're out... 
on Halloween doing whatever. That's totally fine, too. You live your best life, man. So, uh, after this, we're also going to play some uh, Plants vs. Zombies once again. I'm finishing up uh, the last of the campaigns that is in there, and then I'm going to go see a movie after this. So, that's my plan today. I'm going to toss these lights on, because, hey, why not? Um, Zelda Nodge, hello. And, uh, you know, we're doing some fan mail, man. It's going to be good. So, uh, cool. Officially starting the fan mail. The first one is this thing here. Right here. All right. This is from Cookie Gamer, who has put a bunch of stamps on here. One of them being from Alabama, even though you're from Massachusetts. Um, yeah, okay. Uh, three bars of soap asking, what flick, bro? Uh, one of the only uh, superhero movies out right now that is rated R. I'm going to go see Joker. First time I've seen it. And apparently some of my friends are like, this is very messed up. You're not going to like it. And I'm like, you know what? I'm just going to go see it, man. We'll see. We will see. But can I endorse it because it's uh, rated R? Technically, no. But hey, whatever. All right. So, oh, this is, oh, uh, hold on. Okay, so here's stuff in here. Okay, so that's why this has been a, a more common thing here. So uh, he wanted me to sign uh, this uh, envelope we included with uh, postage here. So he sent me his copy or the case for Splatoon 2. I will most certainly sign that for you. He got it pre-owned. And I'm tempted to take the sticker off the back of here. Always take these stickers off, man. You don't need to keep these stickers on. Take them off. I'm tempted. Now, is it a, a, a violation of property if I take the sticker off, even though he might want to keep it on there? Wait, he might have the uh, the warranty, so I won't do that. I won't do that. Okay, cool. There's a return postage here. Uh, always a plus when you include the return postage for something here. Uh, that is ideal. That way I don't have to uh, potentially find a new package for it. It's really sticky at the top. That's all right. So... Yeah, that's always very helpful. If you do that, there's a significantly higher chance that uh, anyone will return your thing. You know, if you had, if for not just me, anyone. Um, from your boy Cookie Gamer, Brian's Dream Team. Okay, cool. So it's a whole dream team of Pokemon here. Uh, we have Gorman, Ezro, Brian's Empoleon, Brian, Brian's Piplup, Brian's Darkrai, and Brian's Score Bunny, sir. You think I'm gonna choose Score Bunny? You think I'm going to choose Score Bunny? Oh, sweet child of mine. Not of mine, but, you know, a sweet child of the, the chat. I don't know, man. I don't know about that. Um, please delete your least favorite IRL friend and accept me, uh, Cookie Gamer. I want to play Splatoon 2 with you. I would be a good challenge. Brian, you can use you catch phrase it's legally trash. Please sign Splatoon 2 inbox. So I won't delete any friends off of my Switch friend list because I never play with anyone anyways. And it's it's sooner that I would remove someone that isn't an IRL friend just to you know clear up the friends list if someone hasn't played uh, their Switch in a while. You know, just to do that. So I, I can't say I'm going to be doing that anytime soon, sir. But I appreciate it. The, uh, the letter, of course, which all letters I do keep. I don't throw anything away. I'm a pack rat in that regard. I have everything set aside. Don't worry. And uh, I will absolutely sign that and put that right in the mail. Uh, probably tomorrow I'll get that done. Uh, Darth Odyssey, hello. Schaefer Shenanigans, hello. Hiram, hello. Um, my signature is not vandalism. Uh, exactly, Pooh Bear. But me taking off the sticker might be considered vandalism. Uh, this is from Florida. Big old envelope here. So let me get the uh, other postage away from here. There's nothing else inside of the letter that Cookie Gamer sent. Excellent. Keep things nice and organized around here. You know how it is? You know how it's going to be? Uh, you do Smash Bros. with the Switch friends list? That's true. But that's only like five people out of like 300 I have on my friends list. So more active people I will keep on there. But even then, if you're not friends with me... Uh, you can just enter in using the code for the room. So, doesn't really matter either way, you know, but yeah. Um, not that I'm going to delete people, you know. Not right now. If it came down to it. I actually uh, removed all of my friends on Xbox because, like, out of all of the platforms that I, um, that I accept messages on, 
Xbox is by far the weirdest. I get ton tossed into 7,000 group chats. People just send weird messages, and I'm like, all right, get my, get my out of here. Cam Cam, hello. Your mom meets dogs, hello. Lippy Show. Uh, Brio, could you cheer for my Houston Astros in the World Series? Considering the Red Sox aren't in the World Series, I will cheer for the Houston Astros, man. Oh, this is a very nicely typed up letter here. Wow, this is a long one, ladies and gentlemen. Get ready. Uh, hello, Brian Saviano, a.k.a. Bricks O'Brien. It's your best subscriber, supporter, and content watcher, Pooh Bear. I love your videos so much. I give them likes, comments, never skip any time during any video, and try to tune into every live stream. Yes, you do, sir. Uh, I, I do see your very valiant effort. Um, these are the playthroughs that you created, and I have completely watched any lists all of them in here uh, Mario Sunshine Maker 2 Season 2 Wii Sports Resort the classic mode for Smash Mario Kart 8 Deluxe Pooh Bear has clearly proven he is a massive Bricks O'Brien fan uh, thank you and I will uh, st and I'm still watching more awesome job on every game Brian five stars the game I want you to see my boy Bricks O'Brien play the most is Super Mario 3D World I know you say it all the time I know I know, I know. I'm waiting for the Switch port. That way, if it has new stuff in it, then I can play it. But that is definitely on the list. I have it. I have the Wii U version right over here, but I'm waiting for the Switch version. So, uh, I want to see Brian's bad skills at meowing it out. This would probably be one of my favorite playthroughs you ever do because it is one of my favorite, if not favorite, Mario games on the Wii U. Well, it's one of the only few Mario games on Wii U, so you don't have many options. I did some videos on my YouTube channel in my playthrough of this game on how to get every green star and stamp in some of the world, so in case you can't find a star or stamp on a level, watch one of my videos, or you can ask me in the comments of one of my videos where to find them. Well, thank you so much. I will uh, definitely keep that in mind. Um, I think I know where every green star and stamp is in the game. Um, good luck meowing it out when you get to it. Come visit Orlando, Florida sometime, bro, because I live in that area, and there's lots of things to do in Orlando. Walt Disney World, Universal, SeaWorld, Fun Spot, and Icon Orlando. I haven't heard of Icon Orlando. Um, are all awesome attractions if you visit. If you have not seen it yet, look up YouTube's. You look up on YouTube, Universal's. Oh, thank you for hosting the stream. Uh, Halloween Marathon of Mayhem show because it is extremely wicked good. It has Stranger Things, Classic Monsters, and Ghostbusters. Uh, cool. Uh, I have seen uh, bits and pieces of the Stranger Things stuff, but I've always wanted to go for uh, Halloween time. That and Disney, for sure. Here are some of your greatest achievements. Banjo-Kazooie Classic Mode. Uh, 300 in Wii Sports Bowling. Capturing Electrobuzz. Building a new chair. Getting the spider off your microphone and liking rice pudding. I'm not counting anything about a girlfriend because no need to bother you about that. I also loved your long dance after 300 in bowling because Brian needs a new pair of shoes. I loved your reaction to Banjo-Kazooie joining Smash and your reaction to Electrobuzz. You're all right. Paper Mario should be in Smash and Waluigi as well. Enough Fire Emblem already. Keep up the good work. Stay healthy. Eat rice pudding. Play Fortnite. And most of all, meow it out as always. Your name has been Brian Saviano, a.k.a. Bricks O'Brien. And you'll see me, Pooh Bear, in the live stream when you read this, hopefully. Peace out. Bye. Bricks O'Brien theme music now playing. P.S. Marshmallow, Three Musketeers for Life, and Green Army Man. Uh, that is fantastic. I love this letter, Pooh Bear. This is awesome. Uh, I appreciate it being very well thought out, very well typed, uh, very well put together. Thank you. This is awesome. And I I'm glad that you thoroughly enjoy seemingly everything I do. I really do appreciate it. And there, like, there's only so much I can say that or, you know, do to, to show that. All I can do is to keep making as many good videos as I can being able to you know take care of myself and take care of you know, the people around me that way I can keep doing what I'm doing so thank you I appreciate it man uh, this is from Jarrett in Texas um, and thank you Pooh Bear for not wanting me to read a mess uh, a lot of these are messes but they're very lovely messes um, Angel asking can we give requests for songs potentially as long as they're family friendly and all that you know you know how it is Angel um Hashtag Team Trees for sure. I, I did read up on that a little bit. Uh, I have to uh, look into that. Um, is that? No. Okay, I thought it was the same name in here. Uh, have you seen the second Man Mandalorian trailer? No, I have not. Um, me two-year-old sister colored this. Oh, cool. Bricks O'Brien. Oh, nice. 
So it's it's like a, a Charizard, Charizamander, I don't know what you want to call that. A lot of Pikachu around here. Uh, the two-year-old sister called this one in, so that's uh, that's great. Fantastic. Thank you. Appreciate it. Excellent drawing there. Of, of Gorman. Well, this is done by uh, age, age seven. So the back, was the back colored by the two-year-old? Okay, the two-year-old colored the back. Okay, cool. Uh, Super Pizza Man, hello. Uh, I actually thoroughly enjoyed Undertale a lot, and I'll probably replay it a second time soon enough, but uh, it'll have to be a little while before that happens. Uh, yes, Schaefer, I am talking to the chat, but I don't just shout out anyone, you know? You can't just ask for a shout out. You gotta have an interesting question or comment or anything, or just say hi, like Family Gaming or Catman, you know? Uh, Sky y Walker is following on Twitch, thank you. So this is from, I don't know what state, Boston? I think it's, uh, no, the Boston's a state. Um, I, th I think it's from the Boston area. Uh, cute little drawing here. Hi, Brian, I love your video. Sincerely, Micah. A little uh, colored in drawing there, excellent. There we go. All right. Nice. So there's that. Uh, there's also quite a few drawings in here. Uh, or this is a letter. Uh, Dear Bricks O'Brien, Bricks O'Brain, play Minecraft Bedrock Edition. They have new updates from Lyndon, the Minecraft fan. There you go. So there's new updates to the Bedrock version. Duly noted. Uh... Okay, so there's one aspect there. You know, the Bedrock version, you can't ban players from the server, which is why I didn't play it as it was. Um, so this is a uh, a drawing of Minecraft. Lots of Minecraft stuff happening here. There's a fox, there's a sun, a bed, uh, the whole underground sequence here. Uh, what is also interesting is that there's this weird sequence of dates on the back of this, ranging from... July 17th to the 26th. I don't know what this means. I don't know what that is for. Were mom and dad like on a spreadsheet or something? Planning out a business thing and then you just grab this piece of paper and that that did it? All right. Uh, uh, maybe. But hey, thank you for the drawing. That's, that's just one of a few here. Still a few more. We also have... Oh, uh, another one. Oh, uh, Wood is hosting with one uh, viewer. Thank you. Um, oh no, I just read that one. I put it in the pile by accident. Oops. All right, I think there's some more drawings in here. Um, oh, yeah, you, you, you all keep sending Pokemon cards. You don't have to do that. Hold on. All right, so dear Brian, um, I, and he wrote the I really fancy like in SpongeBob. Uh, I have been a longtime fan of your funny and entertaining content. It means a lot to me that you would send, spend so much time, effort, and dedication making me and lots of other people happy. My mom appreciates that you do not swear or do not say bad stuff like that. I hope you and your good nature will ent will entertain fans for years to come. Sincerely, Micah, a.k.a. Spaghetti with the Meat. Okay, there you go. I, I see you, man. I see you right there. Oh, it's your dad's work paper. Oh, that's why. <laughs> I'm like, why is, there, why is there a timetable on the back of this piece of paper? Uh, PSI included a print plup card. You don't have to do that. There's a print, two print plup cards right here, ladies and gentlemen. Two, count them, two print plup cards. Oh boy, thank you so much. And here's the um, the fancy eye up there, just like from SpongeBob, man. Super, super fancy eye. There's uh, one more piece of paper in here. And thank you for the Pokemon cards, of course. All right. Uh, this is Whale Lord, uh, the meme Pokemon type meme. Spaghetti with the meat is that? Oh, well, Whale Lord isn't in the chat right now. If you're on Twitch, you can select your own Pokemon, and Whale Lord will appear there over there. Yeah. So, um, uh, Spaghetti with the meat discovered Whale Lord, showed it to his friends, and then was mailed a meme god. Okay. Uh, weight over nine thousand height. You will tell me your weight first. <laughs> <laughs> I think I get that reference. <laughs> That's good. I uh, hope it is in Pokemon Sword and Shield so I can... You erase that word. All right, whatever. There we go. Thank you. Thank you so much. Um, let's see. Um, Team Tree saving the world, of course. Uh, uh, Hunter finishes homework so he gets to watch. Well, excellent. 
I think there's even... Wait, there's one more letter in here? Hold on. There's one more. One more from Micah. Hold on. Um, I really appreciate... I am Austin. Okay. I, I really like your Sonic and Minecraft playthrough. I was wondering if you could start another Ling's... A, 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 Edge page so I can be your friend on Switch and I like Sonic and your playthroughs are entertaining. Could you please watch the TV show Sonic Boom? I think you would enjoy it. Uh, Super Monkey Ball Banana Blitz is getting remastered. Could you play that on the Sonic slide on the Mario and Sonic Tokyo Olympics? Sincerely, Austin. Uh, uh, my friend code is this and my name is Super Sonic. Well, that's a lot of information. Clearly a massive Sonic fan here. Uh, I don't know if... Uh, well, I'm not going to make a third account to register people because it just gets filled up over time. But uh, and, and, like, I don't want to have to delete anyone right now. I know I might eventually. I'm not quite sure. Um, Sonic and... Mar Mario and Sonic at the Olympic Games is probably going to get done. Um, Banana Blitz came out today. And Luigi's Mansion comes out basically tomorrow. So... Probably not going to get to that. I don't know. Uh, the music being played right now is uh, Super Soul Bros from their album Stritches Brew. I play it in the background because it's a uh, pretty funky, jazzy music there. So I do like dinosaurs. Schaefer. Um, let's see. Mr. Beast doesn't need any more fame than he already has. <laughs> well, he's doing a, a really good effort with the Team Trees thing. I did see that. That's very nice. Um, and, you know, all of us, that's the thing. Uh, everyone supports all sorts of different charities that go toward very good efforts. I do charity work for Child's Play. That's where a lot of my charitable efforts go to. So whether it be, you know, you're donating toward trees or you're donating toward uh, kids getting games in hospitals or mental health or whatever sort of research uh, is getting funded through the various uh, donation efforts, it all goes to good causes regardless. So everybody seems to have their own thing, you know. Um, but yeah, so this is from, uh, Burbank, California. Oh boy. Let's see. Um, from O Orion from o, o R I O R. Uh, hi, Brian, uh, uh, to Brian. Hi, I play Minecraft too. My birthday is October 31st. Well, happy early birthday, sir. Can you say happy birthday to me? I am turning six. Happy birthday. Uh, whichever your name is here, sir or madam, there you go, man. Happy birthday. Happy Halloween. Happy birthday. There we go. It doesn't matter where you are donating. Giving is always great. Absolutely, Mr. and Mrs. Steelers. Absolutely. Couldn't agree more. Um, Super Monkey Ball is an arcade game that you can find at Chuck E. Cheese, but also it's an actual game. Uh, there's a remaster of the game that's coming out. It's already out today. So it's Orion. Phantom Orion. Yeah, I, I think it is Orion. Um, ladies and gentlemen, also E-Logger back from the dead. Uh, coming back from his massive escapade over in Europe. He's finally alive and in the chat for the first time, long time. Uh, glad you, you made it out of uh, Europe alive, sir. Good to see you again. Uh, this is from uh, Iman in New Jersey. From Joyzy. Pledge Protector, hello. A uh, fun fact, algae makes up 90% of oxygen, so all trees in the world could be killed and we'd be generally unaffected. Well, looks like Mr. Beast is planting trees for nothing. Let's just forget about the trees and totally disregard all that and instead donate all your money to Bricks O'Brien. I'm kidding. Obviously, I'm kidding. Oh, here's Banjo. Hi to Brian Saviano. I uh, hope you got that white chocolate bunny. I did not. I can confirm I did not get it. Uh, this is Kirby, Banjo, and Kazooie. Uh, right back to me at this location here. Uh, my name is Eamon, and I have been watching you for just about two and a half years. I'm probably your biggest fan. My favorite game is Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland on the GBA SP. Now, are you saying that because I said that's one of the best Kirby games? Because if you have been watching me for that long, and, and it, I don't know how old you are, I'm assuming... Oh, that's a cool drawing of Piplup. Just had to look behind the page here. A little chubby Piplup. Yes, that is. Oh, hold on. 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 Oh, yes. There's such a, a, a chubby Piplup here. Um, yeah, You know, uh, that is way beyond your years, sir. 
but okay. I should play it on camera. I own one of the Bricks O'Brien shirts, and I am asking for the pillow and mug for Christmas. Your biggest fan, uh, Eamon, uh, if you would like to write back, please do. Well, thank you. Uh, here's that drawing of uh, Banjo, Kazooie, and Kirby. And yes, Kirby Nightmare in Dreamland is one of my favorite Kirby games of all time. And uh, clearly has a great taste here. So uh, give Brian all the Dunkin' Donuts gift cards. He asked for it in Paper Mario. Listen, with the holidays coming up, I'm not saying that it's going to be a busy holiday season. And I need as many Dunkin' Donuts gift cards as I can get. But if you want to take any energy you have that would be sending me things... Send me Dunkin' Donuts gift cards to get me through this this holidays here, man. I'm going to be recording videos like crazy. Um, Pledge Protector has been uh, watching me uh, ever since I started putting up videos. So, yeah, thank you, man. I appreciate it. Glad you could make it for a live stream over on the Mixer Peanut Gallery. This is from uh, Jonas in Kentucky. So here we go. Oh, Eli's on a plane. Did you pay for Wi-Fi to watch this, dude? Because that Wi-Fi in the sky is not good. Let me know how many feet you are in the air, Eli. Or you're on the airplane, or did you just land? He might have just landed, actually. I was going to say, if you paid for Wi-Fi to watch this, that's not worth the $25 you probably paid <laughs> to have the Wi-Fi activated, man. Three Musketeer coffee for Brian, yeah. Um, my name is Jonas. I'm a big fan. If you want to play Minecraft, my name is this on Minecraft. Uh, please send a letter if you waff to play Minecraft if you want it says waff but I know he means want right there that totally looks like waff because it or, or it's switched it's what but it looks like waff but yeah I, I totally get the idea uh, Octo J hello Eli's on the ground just landing in Boston man there you go there you go uh, fun facts about Brian he hates Sonic he, he likes Chick-fil-a and one of the first people he worked for was uh, Total Toys. Well, wow. uh, this channel was made before that channel, the Brick Show, went off. That is half true, half not. Actually, most of that's not true. Yeah, most of what you said is actually not true. But uh, thank you for sending in the letter. Um, and Octo J, you can totally send in a letter. It just takes a stamp and a piece of paper, and you just send it in, and that's it. And you can send it to the address that's obviously. Uh, right over here, 321 Main Street, number 1448, Wakefield, Massachusetts, 01880. Yeah, if you can't, that's fine. Um, let's see. My recommended made me an offer I can't refuse. There you go. Nice. Uh, when you're done with the campaign of Plants vs. Zombies, will you play online? Yes, I will. I totally will. Um, I don't hate Sonic. I don't like most Sonic games, but contrary to a playthrough you're going to see in a little while, I definitely don't hate Sonic. Uh, this is from Micah in Texas. In Texas. So here we go. Nice letter here. Uh, Dear Brian, I love watching your videos and seeing you play them. I also really want to play Minecraft Battle Mode on the PS4 with you. Don't forget to feature this letter in a fan mail video. I haven't subscribed yet, but I will eventually. I also don't have a PlayStation account yet either. So, Micah wants me to play on PlayStation with him, even though he doesn't own a PlayStation and he's not subscribed. Well, ladies and gentlemen, if you're not subscribed yet, well, come on now, man. It's free. Subscribe on YouTube. It's free, man. Come on, man. Come on. That's all right. That's all right. Well, thank you for writing in and telling me that you're not subscribed to the channel. And once you get that PS4, well, by that time, it might be the PS5 at that point, you know. Um, give him his dream, Brian. Um, what's your Fortnite name? It is the same as my YouTube channel name. It's Brian Saviano, all one word. It's not Bricks O'Brien, unfortunately. Um, I was only around when he started doing Minecraft. Yep. All it takes is pushing that subscribe button. Pooh Bear, you're right, man. You're totally right. This is from Dunn in Roswell, New Mexico. That's where the aliens live, kids. That's where Area 51 is, unless he just put the address, the return address, to uh, uh, that. He might have, but uh, capital B, capital S on that as well, um, uh, Schaefer. Um, yeah, Roswell, New Mexico. Interesting. All right. Uh, so here's a letter. Oh, it's a double-sided, neatly written letter. Much appreciated. Uh, hi. 
I watch all your videos and recently started watching your live streams. The reason for this is I do not know that you did streams. Plus, I usually watch you on Prime. Uh, when you read this, I should be watching. Even if I'm not, I will watch the replay. I would like your PlayStation username and DS friend code. Oh, the DS I never put. That, that friend code. I couldn't even tell you what that friend code is, dude. I know how to friend request on DS if you need help. Also, I have taken note of every rice pudding you have said. I know you say, by any means of the internet, tell me this phrase, but I don't have the ability to do that. So I hope this works. Rice pudding, burnt toast, rice pudding, Chinese food, rice pudding, Spidey, rice pudding, sunshine, rice pudding, ghost, rice pudding, King DDD, rice pudding, holiday, rice pudding, sunshine, finale, and rice pudding, goldfish. I would do rice pudding baseball, but I didn't watch that series since it isn't Bricks O'Brien. It is Brick Show Brian. Oh, thank, oh, thank you. So you get on my good side. Uh, I am writing for certain series remakes like uh, Super Mario Sluggers. Tropical Freeze and Color Splash. So you want me to do it with face cam and all that uh, and the higher quality microphone. Uh, the only one that would probably get remastered of those... Remastered. Of those three would be Color Splash, but I want to do Super Paper Mario first. So I did the first Paper Mario, skipping Thousand Year because that's my final series ever. Super Paper Mario, then I'd skip Sticker Star, go to Color Splash. So I'm basically like hopping every other you know, step with the Paper Mario series. So, yeah. Um, I I will definitely... And if I play Color Splash, I'm going to finish it. I know the last series... Uh, whatever. So, that, that series will never be finished. But the new series, yes. Um, you never see me in the chat because I watch you on a fire stick, so I'm unable to chat. I also don't have a sign-in. Last but not least, I really would love to meet you in real life, but I live in New Mexico, and the closest thing you get to New Mexico is Texas. Plus, my family only travels once a year, and that's to Indiana from Dallas. P.S. My name is pronounced Dallas. It's it's spelled D-A-L-U-S, but it's Dallas. So, Dallas, if you are there, sir, as I knock on the chair, no, I'm going to knock on the table here. Sir, hello. Hi. Uh, you're never in the chat, apparently, but a very uh, nicely written letter here. Greatly appreciated, sir. Uh, thank you for writing such a kind letter. And uh, I will probably do... Color Splash might be... When would that get done? January? Maybe? I don't know. We'll see. Depends how long Pokemon takes me, how long... Uh, no, Pokemon should be done by December. What am I going to do for videos in December, dude? I don't know. Uh, this one is from someone I've never encountered before um, in, a, in a chat or anything else from Ileana Dickey in uh, Pennsylvania. Uh, the Dickey family. Always very kind and generous. Uh, the excellent drawings here, Ileana. I'm liking it. The, the Pikachu with the pumpkin head and the bat. Oh, boy. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, they are a household full of Patriots fans, as I do understand. Um, they actually gave me... Uh, they. Uh, let me rephrase this. They donated money to me directly. Uh, that way, I could buy a Tom Brady jersey, uh, autograph it, and send it back to them. Uh, that's how much they love... Tom Brady and the New England Patriots, man. Big, big fans in the in the Dickey household. Um, do platinum in December? Ooh, don't tempt me. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Steelers are like, please stop. 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 Hold up. Now, Amplify has a wrong opinion. I think the Dickey family and I can both agree that the Panthers are trash. We're not even going with that, man. Not even go with that. Sorry, Amplify. Uh-uh. I think we could both come to terms on that one. This is a, this is a thick one here. It's a thick one. All right. Uh, we Mixer people have to stick together. Yes, you do in the Mixer peanut gallery. Uh, so, Brian, I made you a Mario uh, Mario Espion. Wait. Epi Ep Espion. Help me translate here. <laughs> Um, and a Zelda Pikachu. I am so happy you chat, ch chatted your, <laughs> wow, this stuff, your shiny. Oh, you, you caught your shiny Nidoran. Yes, I did. I caught the shiny Nidoran Espeon Mart. There it is. There. Oh, that's Espeon on the, no, that's a bat. That's a bat. I thought it was Espeon. No. Okay. Here we go. Your shiny Nidoran in Pokemon Go. I have Nidorina, Peace Meow Out from Ileana. So there's an Espeon on the very bottom here. 
Excellent. Oh, there's a lot of stuff here. Oh, okay, lots of drawings. There's an Espeon right down there. I'm taking it that uh, her favorite Pokemon is Espeon. Mario Espeon here, I get you. So it's an Espeon with uh, the, the Mario hat on. I understand it now. There you go. Excellent drawing there. Uh, we also have uh, Zelda Master Pikachu in Mario World. Quite the interpretations you got here, Ileana. I'm liking the creativity. Lots of color, lots of personality here. Looking fantastic. Uh, Octo J, have a great night. Um, Tegan says hi. Well, hello, Kim and Tegan. Um, yeah, that that's great. We also have another one here. This is uh, random Pokemon food with a bonus pizza cat with some stickers as well. Lots of cats. Lots of cats meowing it out here. Lots and lots of cats. <laughs> there we go. Uh, pizza cat. That sounds actually really delicious here. Um, oh, and Pooh Bear, or ra rather Uncle Bricky. Uh, the one person who disliked is the one person who thinks that the Panthers are actually uh, good at football. Sorry, Amplify. Love you. Uh, this is creepy but cute cat, question mark? Uh-oh. Here we go. There it is. Very, you know, if I saw that cat, like, staring me down as I, uh, I woke up, man... I don't know if I'd be happy about that one. That's uh, that's not looking great. Uh, it's it's looking great, but it looks kind of terrifying. So thank you, Ileana. Uh, bonus points. Anyone who writes on the envelope, obviously make the address very legible here. So make sure it looks just like that. But anyone who writes on the back, I keep the envelopes as well. So otherwise, if there's no drawings, I do uh, toss them just so there's not a bunch of stuff everywhere. I don't hang on to anyone's address or anything like that. So, But excellent work, Ileana. I like all the drawings. Fantastic. Uh, do you have the uh, Luigi inflatable costume yet? I'm not saying anything, Pooh Bear. Uh, what's up, Brian? What's up, DJ? How you doing, man? Uh, I didn't dislike. They are bad, though. <laughs> All right. Well, Amplify is over on the Twitch verse, holding down the fort, man. All right. So this is from uh, Jake in California. All the way from Cali, where it's a lot sunnier than it is over here as of right now. And I'm surprised nobody changed their Pokemon to a Wailord. You know? Oh, this is Mario. It, it Hold on. It says, this is Mario. That is Mario. There he is. Look at that. That's Mario. Pretty good. Uh, how many here have watched Brian and when he was the family gamer? Well, I was there. Um... Amplify, I'll take you off parole for the Luigi's Mansion stream. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. Uh, dear Bri Brick, Br Brick So Brian, I love all of your video, your fan, Jake H5. Well, thank you, Jake. Appreciate it. And the Mario drawing as well. There's a Werelord. There he is. Is that Darth Odyssey right there? That must be, man. That must be him. All right, cool. Well, thank you for the, uh, the letter and the drawing of Mario. Excellent. So, uh, this one is totally, absolutely decked out to the nines, ladies and gentlemen. Um, uh-oh, Amplify is going out with friends on Halloween and not being here for seven hours while I stream Luigi's Mansion? How dare you, sir? No, obviously, go ahead. Uh, this one's decked out to the nines. Wow, look at that. Lots of stickers. The, the, the guy at the post office must have been like, what are you doing? Who is this and why? So I, I initially got this, and I'm like, why? What? So it says ten dollars in five to, to, tolo months stuff, fan stuff. Ooh, that's what it says. I, can anyone translate? Can anybody translate in here? Anyone? No, amplify. Don't bring your phone. Don't worry about it, man. Don't don't even worry about it. I'm good. You you have fun on Halloween, you know. Um. I mean, I like my hands right like an actual printer. Ooh, more like a typewriter. Cool. Uh, I don't I don't know, man. I, I can't decipher. But I'm just going to open it up and see what happens. Um, hopefully there's not... Never send me money, ladies and gentlemen. Don't send me money. Send me drawings, letters, pictures, and all that, you know? Always be safe and all that. All right. Cool. So to and from... Did you... What is the... What is... Okay. Uh, hold on. This is um, from Tyler to Brian Savano 
I'm your number one fan. Brian Savano. There it is, man. Name change number 55. <laughs> Amplifies like it says. <laughs> uh, Brian, I'm probably going to be out, but I really want to watch Luigi's Mansion 3. You can watch the replay afterward, man. It's no problem. Watch it at your own pace. Don't have to sacrifice your Halloween to watch me. Um, I'll explain it in a second here. Uh, I'm your biggest fan. I love your videos. Plus, would like to make more. Uh, I would like to see more Wii U video games. Uh, how many do you have? Uh, I think like four. Because everything else has been remastered for Switch. Uh, your biggest fan, Tyler. Thank you, Tyler. And there's also another little thing in here. Uh, don't be like Amplify. Amplify actually spent mo uh, sent money, which actually went to uh, the raffle that we did for, uh, for charity. Uh, so this is a very... Um, what is this texture? Oh, it's just crayon. It's just very heavily crayoned in, where it almost has a different texture to the paper uh, from your biggest fan. That's a tiger. Tiger meowed it out in the jungle right there, man. That is that is the definition of meowing it out. Cool. But well, thank you. Lots of lots of crayon on that. Yeah, there we go. I don't know what it was, about $10. Um, Angel asking, do I accept gifts? So I don't know. So I, I don't want people to send me stuff because then it gets out of hand and people are going to send me video games that I probably already have. Or games that I don't have any intention of playing. And I don't want to sell stuff. If you give me stuff, I keep it. Like, um, you know, I don't want to I don't want to do that. So I just say don't send me stuff. Send me letters, drawings, or whatever. Uh, if you want to send that Rob, that's totally your choice. And it'll go back here. It'll absolutely stay back here pretty much forever. So if you do, go ahead. That's fine. But, like, I don't want... I basically say that so kids don't send me their video games. I don't want that to happen. If you send me, like, a game case, if you send me a case with the, the mailer back, ah, I'll, I'll sign it, you know? I'll do that, but don't send me games, don't send me stuff, because I don't, n don't do that. Um, send you three, send you Marshmallow Three Musketeers. If you find Marshmallow Three Musketeers, you let me know can't find them anywhere gone At, like I, I can't i can't find them dude they're just not available uh what about sponsors that's different because they're giving me money <laughs> so like that's different so like you know if bubbly or whoever wants to spot and put like seltzer water cooler back here then that's fine but not not from any of you guys and girls don't send me stuff um send me dunkin donuts gift cards if you want to that is the only thing of things i will accept because going into Luigi's Mansion, going into Pokemon, Christmas time, I'm going to be in overdrive. If you want to send me caffeine in the form of Dunkin' Donuts gift cards and nothing else, no Starbucks, no Tim Hortons, no Popeyes, no Wendy's, McDonald's, Denny's, or IHOP, just Dunkin' Donuts. If you want to do that, I'll accept it. I'll accept it. That's the only thing I'll accept. Okay, cool. C could I send you my Mario Odyssey box and Traveler's Guide to sign? Yes. Yes. But include, the thing is, include postage back. So put, like, a bubble mailer back in here. And, like, so what happened with Ben is he put the stamps and stuff on it. So I just put it in the box and I'm done. That is the best way for any, like, any, if you send someone anything to sign, not just me, anyone, that do that. That is very, very, very helpful. And I only say that, don't send me Starbucks gift cards. Um, I only, like... All right. If you do send me gift cards, great. If you don't, whatever. The real request is if anyone has any, like, you know, holiday cards and stuff, you know, like handwritten cards and stuff, that's actually going to be what I request for fan mail and whatnot. Like, if I have to make a request or anything. But, yeah. I will send you everything you said not to. Well, don't do that. Uh, this is from uh, Barlet in Dallas, Texas. This is the next one here. We got uh, two more pieces of fan mail here. And then we'll get rocking with some uh, Plants vs. Zombies. Just got a little bit to go, and then I'm out of here. Um, this is Mario. Ooh, Paper Mario. There we go. Excellent. He's doing like a split, kind of. It looks like... Yeah, it definitely looks like he's doing a split. Cool. There you go. So there he is. And there's also another little bit of uh, mail in here as well. Uh, my name is Sahara. What is your favorite character in Smash Bros.? 
Game and Watch. Yeah, Mr. Game and Watch. I'm thinking like, cause Paper Mario's not in the game. Who would it be? It's Mr. Game and Watch. Uh, I am nine years old and I play Fortnite. My name on Fortnite is Jingle Bells Twenty Four. I like that name. I love your videos. Well, thank you. Appreciate it. It looks like a red Luigi. It did kind of look like a red Luigi. It's it's the shape of the face, is really what did it there. But uh, excellent work on the red Luigi, re slash. It is Mario. It's got you know the M, but it, I, it the facial structure, is definitely Luigi for sure. Um, no Minecraft or Ark. Uh, I play Minecraft sparingly. Ark Survival, no. Um, but yeah. Um, let's see. What's the weird Lego-looking thing by your Meta Knight? This? Oh, wait. Um, which, I'll show you all three. Well, I'll show you one. Hold on. So, uh, no, not you. This is Banjo. So this I actually bought from a... Um, a Lego builder on Instagram, uh, Pino Creations. Actually, I'll, I'll link his stuff later. This is Banjo and Kazooie made out of Lego. Stellar job. Absolutely stellar. I love this right here. And then uh, the other little thing. Hold on. This is a um, a Mario that was made by Eclipse Graphics that I got at Brick World Chicago. It's pretty cool. Let's see if I can actually show you this here. Hold on. There we go. I should focus. Yeah, there we go. So it's Cappy with Mario and a coin and whatnot. So that's pretty cool. Um, Lane, uh, tell me to play Luigi's Mansion when it comes out. Sir, if you tune in uh, Thursday at 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, I'm going to be playing through Luigi's Mansion live and recording for my playthrough. So if you want to tune into that, you certainly can. After or before your uh, trick-or-treating on the 31st, tune in live. And I'll be live from 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time until I get tired, which could be who knows how long, you know. And if you are out trick-or-treating and whatnot, don't worry. Um, you know, take your time doing that. Don't worry about me. You can watch the video afterward. It's all good. Um, can you PayPal me $60? No, London, I can't. Um, uh, Mini-Me2910 is now following on the Mixer Peanut Gallery. Thank you, sir or madam. This one's from Gavin over in... Uh, Nebraska. So, um, I've seen, so in the town that my office is in, they did trick or treating Sunday. They did it on Sunday at like 4 p.m. So, not everyone's going to be trick or treating. So, I, I don't know what the policy is where you live, but some days it's like dictated to be a, uh, you know, a normal day or they change Halloween to be a different day or whatever. Um, but trick or treating for the uh, the Dickey family might be rained out. Uh, when is Car Stream Two coming? Car Stream or Chair Stream? Either of which I don't know. Uh, oh, we have a Ampolion drawing here. Excellent. So here's the first one from ColoringPages101.com. Not sponsored, not hashtag ad, but there you go. Excellent drawing, or rather, a coloring in job of Ampolion there. And uh, let's see. Um, yeah, it is very early, but it's just so kids aren't running around at nighttime, you know, for Halloween, because that, you know, some parents obviously don't want their kids running around in the middle of the night. Uh, I love your videos. I've been watching them since 2017. Uh, I know you have not been at. I know you have not been at Boston lately, but I would like you to post some more videos of 100 things to do in Minecraft are the ones I want the most. I can't change your mind on what videos you record, but I hope you will consider my request from uh, Gavin. P.S. My middle name is Brian. Ooh, that's a good middle name, and it's spelled the right way, too. It is spelled different. Oh, it's spelled different than it's pronounced, but it's the same as your first name. P.S. Number two, I hope you like the picture. I do like the picture. So, um, 100 Things to Do in Minecraft is definitely um, one of the most requested series for me to get back to. I've just run out of things to do. So without involving other players or other things, like, I can build stuff, but that's not necessarily, you know, like, what, what you know, what I want to do, you know? Um, Amplify saying I should improve my stream overlay. You know, I'd love to actually make it super hardcore, but, like, I don't know what else I would do, you know? Like, I, I want to get, like, stuff custom done, but, like... I, I, you know, that's money and all that. And then, like, the resources and all that, so... 
Um, it's not not spelled brain. It's probably B R Y A N or something like that. Next singing stream, I don't know. I don't know when, but when it happens, it'll be a good one. Trust me. Uh, this is from James in South Carolina. The final letter for this fan mail opening for October 2019. I do use OBS. Um. Uh, add add admiration and self promotion. LOL. Uh, take care and thanks again. Wait, hold on. What? Ad admiration? Yeah, it's in cursive. Obviously, I should read it. Admi admiration and self promotion. L uh, okay. Wait, I'm trying to think. Like, is that referring to what? Anyways, hold on. Hello there, Brian. Uh, it's heroic white. Ah, uh, yeah, I know who you are. Hello, hello, heroic white. Some epic fan art. You know me, so I don't really have to introduce myself. Um. Also, to any current viewers, you should like, subscribe, and follow Brian. And after that, subscribe to Heroic YT on YouTube. Have a fantastic day. Goodbye. Sincerely, Heroic YT. So that's Mom who wrote that, who I met at the Lego store along with Heroic YT. So there we go. That is the final letter as of right now. You know, you can send in more fan mail on the address that you see in the top right-hand corner. Uh, 321 Main Street. Take a screen cap, why don't you? 321 Main Street, number 1448. Ladies and gentlemen, it's right here. Right there, bam. Uh, let, let's just, just to emphasize, hold on. Give me a second here. I just want to emphasize one more time. Send fan, uh, my mail. Oh, geez. Brian Saviano, 321 Main Street, number 1448, Wakefield, Massachusetts, in case you don't get the picture, ladies and gentlemen, there it is. All right, cool. So uh, that's it for fan mail for right now. I do always get great fan mail. I, I absolutely agree. Uh, I am incredibly thankful. I'm going to minimize this here, make this a little bit more professional. Uh, I, I always appreciate all the fan mail that I get and appreciate hearing from all of you. That really is what keeps me motivated to keep doing this day after day. It's not about money or admiration or any of that sort of stuff. It's all about, you know, uh, it's all about, you know, hearing from all of you. <laughs> and um, who, who said Pooh Bear's like, my eyes, my eyes. Um, let's see. You want to be professional, eh? Listen, Amplify. If you think you can be more professional than me, go ahead. Go ahead. Stay on parole. Uh, I stream, I use Streamlabs OBS. So, yeah. Uh, but I do want to get it actually, you know, done upright. Is uh, he heroic, Brian? He is heroic. I'd say so. And this is Jay-Z Megalovania. Brian, what's my favorite cheese? What's your favorite cheese? Uh, uh, mozzarella. Say mozzarella. Um, Ileana Meow Meow. And what do you think the scariest movie of all time is? Hmm, I don't know. Scare I don't watch a lot of scary movies. So you know. I'm not really Yeah, I'm not really a scary movie guy. Uh also side note, I don't know if I did I say this on stream earlier? I did. So there are moves being made, ladies and gentlemen. Your boy Brian Saviano, Bricks O'Brien. Always cooking up something, all right? I happen to get these that are going to be available for re you know, situations eventually. Bricks O'Brien stickers, if you are interested here. These are things that are going to be going out. I slapped one on my computer. You can now slap the animated version of my face anywhere you want to. I've got 250 of these bad boys here. They look fantastic. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There we go. Is it going to be a part of something else that will be available soon? We'll have to wait and see. Have to wait and see, but yes. On top of all the things in the merchandise store. Um, yes. So, uh, how much? Ooh. So, th uh, they're not on sale yet. These are not for sale yet, but I do have a ton of them. So, you, you will know more very soon. But this is this is it. right? This is part of it right here. Yo, face look nice. Hey, man. I like to think so. I would like to think so. Um, let's see. For you, it's the Exorcist. That's a good one. My parents will buy them for me, please. I know that. I know they probably will. Uh, 
But yeah, I'll, I'll let you know. I will let you know as soon as I can. But yes, this is a thing here. So uh, the other, only other thing I had on the docket here was to uh, finish up the second of the campaigns in uh, Plants or well, campaigns uh, in uh, Plants vs Zombies: Battle for Neighborville of the Zombies. So I've done all four so far. Uh, they are not six dollars each. They are about a third of that cost, I would say. If you want to buy those, you know you can. Um, the merchandise store has been updated with designs here. Oh, we're going to go to the Camden game here. So this is what we're going to be doing. But um, while this is all loading up here, I'll link to the store once again in case you have not seen it. Uh, the background skyline has been updated, and it's going to be updated across everything soon enough. But there you go. Uh, if you want to check that out, keep it for uh, you know your own tabs. You certainly can and uh, whatnot. But yeah. Uh, I'm just going to make my way over toward this area here. We'll get rocking and rolling in just a second. All right. Uh, they need to save up for retirement. Yeah, there you go. Um, Barney's scary because he's a dinosaur around children. You know what? That, that'd be terrifying for me too, man. But, you know, that's all right. All right. So let's cut this. Uh, as much as I love Megalomania here. Also, did you guys and girls see the Undertale playthrough? Did you like that? Did you enjoy that? Hopefully you uh, all found it still relevant and whatnot i know it's very a very long time after the fact but yeah um see you later joel have a good night uh i know it's you know a bit of old news kind of but you know hopefully you enjoyed it maybe i'll do the pacifist run eventually maybe next halloween who, who knows we'll see it is snack time for iliana well enjoy your snack time tell you mom and dad to have a great night thank you so much for tuning in and sending in mail and being awesome overall um, let's see. I had my remote. Here we go. I got to up the volume on this bad boy right here. There we go. The mug is updated. Before it was, um, the full body logo and the, you know, the Bricks O'Brien logo. Now it's just the face. I think it looks a little bit better. And it's available in blue now. So I can't wait for your pacifist playthrough, especially the genocide run. We'll see. One thing at a time, Angel. One thing at a time. I think Pacifist will come first. But, you know, we'll see. If it's in high enough demand, we'll see. But uh, I think it uh, it's also it's also an issue of uh, what new stuff is coming out or old things I want to get to as well, you know. So, one thing at a time. But, yeah, we're going to finish up the remainder of uh, this campaign here. And then uh, go see Joker with a bunch of my friends. Hi, P. Ew, you stink like cult. Okay. What's that? You need some stickers? Oh, ladies and gentlemen, you need stickers. I got your stickers right here. I got all 250 of these you could ever want right there, man. There you go. All right. So, yeah, we're, again, still doing this thing with the cult. It's just a very odd situation, you know? Like, why is this a thing, you know? My cookies smell strong. Follow your nose holes to sniff them out. I will follow the smell of the cookies as much as I can. All right, let's let's get a move on here. All right, so it's clearly going down. Well, before it was going down, but now I'm actually going in the right direction here. Um, I'm just gonna keep moving and not bother with any of the other enemies around here. Just not worth the time. You can just skip right through them as we know from before. Uh, this looks like this is where it should be at. Let's clear these guys and girls out just because. You know that sunflower she's been putting out fires put her out. All right. Well, if you say so, man. I guess that's what it'll take. All right. There we go. Oh, yeah. Just everything. The whole kitchen sink thrown at once here, man. Just the whole kit and caboodle. There we go. Little acorn, buddy. Relax, acorn. Get out of here. No. No, 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 no. Okay. I guess not. Maybe not. There you go. The one acorn is done. Done. Okay, cool. Stop. Stop. I'm going to hide behind the wood planks. Really? It's still getting at me after that distance away? That's kind of ridiculous. Okay. Uh, I need to dig up the cookies here in just a second. I want to heal up, obviously. So just going to launch it down this way just so they don't bother me, you know? There we go. Launch it. Launch it. Launch it. There we go. There's one. All right. Dig them up. Let's go. So we just got to dig up cookies and then uh, fight the boss, and we should be good, right? You know? Um, 
My cookies are not basic. Keep sniffing. Okay. Uh, sure. Let's go toward the cookie smell again. Is it this way? It is this way. Okay. Nope. Those are going to destroy me. Nope. Keep going. Avoid all the dandelions. All, every single one of them. Because those are the ones that'll just destroy you without any hesitation at all. And I'm losing the scent. It's over down this way, it seems. Yep, definitely. Okay. And avoid the pea shooter. Just keep jumping. Keep jumping and going. Is it in the pit right there? It might be in the pit right here. Yes, it is. There we go. Tree's still rising out of the ground, man. I don't know. Oh, that's a, that's a situation here. Okay. There we go. Nice. Cool. Well, there's one. Done, I guess. Okay. Uh, vanquish nearby enemies. Oh, okay. Nope. Get away, get away, get away. Stay away. There we go. Nice. Very picky indeed. That's where the cookie's going to be. Cookie time. Cookie time. Cookie time. 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 Going to block this out. And dig them up. Oh, they're eaten again. That's not good. Oatmeal raisin. We're looking for cookies, not garbage. Excuse me. Raisin oatmeal is just good enough, okay? It's not too bad. You know, you gotta change that attitude. Change that ringtone real quick. Okay, is it this way? It is this way. Alright, looks like somewhere... Not down this way. Over this way. Okay. Where is it? I can't tell. Oh, there's a lot happening here. A lot happening here. Okay. Oh, there it is. Okay, cool. Destroy that. Nope. You gotta destroy everything else first. My bad. Do this. There we go. Don't forget to destroy the sunspot. I know. Give me a second here. Give me a second. Give me a second. There we go. Alrighty. That's what I wanted. Cool. Why would you even put raisins in cookies, dude? I, I mean, raisin cookies are okay. Like, I mean, they're just, they're not overwhelmingly sweet, you know? They're just kind of there. Which is better than not being there, you know? Oh, that's a boss. Oh, no, it's a, that's a big boy. Okay. Oh, he's on our side. I forgot. Oh, okay. It's not that big of a deal then. I thought we'd have to destroy him, but no. They're, they're, they're fairly tasty, I would say, overall, you know? It's not overwhelmingly sweet like most chocolate chips or chocolate chip cookies in general. I mean, raisins by themselves, I'm not that big of a fan of. So, like, I mean... It's tolerable. Like, they're not that sweet. Like, it's just enough sweetness with the actual cookie is what really makes it, in my opinion. And this whole base is now getting infiltrated, which before it was the zombie hideout. So I don't know how that all works, but whatever. It's going to take care of all you. Get him out. Get him out. Where are you going, man? You good? Oh, you need my guidance. I forgot. Okay, stop. Nope. There we go. All right. I don't know what the... Uh, boss of the area is, but I guess the bomb is going to be combating it regardless, you know? And hopefully that little acorn buddy is still just chilling over there. Alright, whatever. You know what? Not even gonna bother. Just gonna keep moving. Um, uh, why are these trees moving? You know what I mean? Like, why? Like, it just seems like a lot, you know? It seems like they just are very angsty. They can't really make up their minds. And we're just watching this guy walk. And, oh, okay. That's aggressive. That is aggressive. Okay. All right. Uh, Dreadwood tossed my cookie so rude. Well, let's grab the cookies. Oh, deliver the, to yourself to my last spot here. Oh, oh, these guys are healing up. Okay. Can't have any of that nonsense now, can we? There we go. Infiltrate. Go. Go. I'm not really destroying any one of them, I'm doing damage to all of them, and they're all healing themselves. So that's just terribly inconvenient there. Come on. There we go. All right, do this. Get some more damage done. It's just it's just a bit, you know. There we go. That took a lot more effort than I wanted it to. Okay. And now the the boss here is a giant sunflower. Oh yes it is. The Sunflower Queen battle this royale. Is that a diss on Fortnite? I feel like it is, man. I feel like low-key, that's a diss toward Fortnite, which you know what? I guess that's okay. 
potentially. You know, if you want to battle royale it out, you know. There you go. Do some damage. Is that, did that actually do damage? It doesn't seem like it. Not as much. But, you know. Uh-oh. Nope. The Sunflower Queen charged up. Uh, okay. Um, got a Sun Spore Blast. Okay. Destroy the Sun Spots. Where are the Sun Spots? Uh, oh, in here. Oh, okay. Oops. And I have 15 seconds to do so? Oh, no. Okay. Let's hopefully just get one of them. That'll increase the time, hopefully. There we go. It kind of doesn't. Kind of does. Okay. Let's do that. We're good. Do I need to get all of them? I think I do. Jeez. All right. Well, there's only three. That's not too bad. I thought it'd be a, a little bit worse here, but no. We're good. Actually, that one I might not actually get. Huh. Okay. Uh, oh, I needed to aim upward? Yeah, no way. Not a chance. Come on. Nope. Didn't get it. Oh, no. Okay. Am I dead? Too slow. The queen healed. She's stronger and smells nicer. Dang. Ouch. Okay. So, okay. Uh, give me a second here. Give me a second. Let me heal. Give me a half. Just don't come over here. Stop. Now you're fully healed. So I probably should have known. Oh, and you got little buddies with you too. Okay. Sure. You know what? That makes things a lot more difficult. There we go. Just try to... I'm going to try to spam all of them at once. There we go. That's a real solution there. There we go. And now where are you going, man? Hey, man. Come on now. Come on now. Where are you going, man? And there we go. Do that. That seemingly did nothing. Okay, great. Avoid. Maybe try to heal. I don't know. Nope. Come on. That's not doing anything to anything at all. No. Don't heal the, su the sunflower. Oh, the sunflower totally restored all of its health. Should I just retry the whole battle? Maybe. I don't know. Very invocative of uh, Undertale here with the whole slaughtering of the sunflower thing. That whole concept in general. Right? And I'm going to totally die right here. Yep. I feel like that's going to happen. Come on. I got to spam all sorts of stuff here. I'm going to turn on the fan. It's getting very, uh, very, oh, the fan mail, oh, it's blowing everywhere. Okay, never mind. Oops, my bad. So it seems like I'm kind of losing control of the situation here because the sunflower keeps respawning and it's just not working out for me. Where is the sunflower now? You're over here. Okay. I'm going to try to fast forward through this in the playthrough that way that does nothing okay noted uh, I'm just gonna try to get this done here um, it is not fan mail anymore playing plants vs zombies uh, because uh, I read through all the fan mail so yeah okay you'd root for a murderer he's actively killing our planet oh no technically yes you're right Technically, yes. Just sing Post Malone Sunflower and you'll beat it. You know, I wish it was that simple, Pooh Bear. I really wish it was. There we go. Come on. And I feel like these... Um... Oh, it's taking me down to half health. Okay. Oh, I'm taking it down to half health. Okay. There we go. There we go. All right, so now I'm at half health with that. So now, it was stronger before, but now at least I should have some time to get to the sunspots. Where are they? Where are they? There they go. All right, so one's down here. Cool. One, two, three, four, five. Is it five? It's five. Okay, cool. Give me a little bit of time here just so I can get my bearings. I'm going to ignore the uh, enemies here. Okay. Because I definitely don't want to lose track here. Oh, get her while she's weak. Okay, so now it only took two times, even though I needed to get it like three times that time. All right. You know what? That works. Sure. Okay. Um, this doesn't really do anything. Uh, that certainly doesn't do anything either. Not for this boss battle here. All right. 
I'm hoping I can just get this taken care of in another... Oh, not another shot. Okay, cool. So let's avoid this. I don't know where I'm getting attacked from still. Oh, over here. Sniper rifles. Of course. Of course there's snipers over here. Duh. Why wouldn't there be, you know? Okay. Oh, I'm wasting time here. Okay. Um, that's okay. It's made a 90% oxygen with the algae here. So... Five. Nope. Nope. Not going to let it happen. Not going to let it happen. Come on. There we go. Come on. I'm definitely going to lose it. Yep, for sure. Nope. Do I have it? I don't know, man. I don't know. Uh, yep, I totally lost it. Dang it, really? That stinks. That super... St Wait, did I get it? Oh, really? I need to get more? How? Oh, that's ridiculous. That's kind of ridiculous, dude. I don't know how that's going to work. Oh, wow. How did it let me do that? How did it let me do that, dude? No way. No way I got all of them. Wow. Oh, wow. I got that done in, like, the absolute nick of time right there. That was totally, totally not how that was supposed to go, dude. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice. Well, now the sunflower should be defeated. Really? Again? That's obnoxious. That's very obnoxious. Okay. Okay. All right. Not going to waste time. Just going to deny. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. That's a bit much. This is definitely a bit much here. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. It's scripted. Okay. I thought it might be a... Uh, uh, okay. Okay. There we go. Yep. Nice. And... Oh, a big bomb from the sky. Oh, is it going to take care of both of them? And it does. Alrighty then. Zombie prepared quest complete. It's done. Cool stickers have been acquired. And uh, that is it for each of the uh, the things here. So um, now there's just the boss, right? Because we got to go to the boss door. Where is that? Oh, uh, the boss door is way over. Not here. That's the gnome door. We have all three pieces that we need. Or we got to talk to the big boss right now, right? I think so. That might be it. Nope. Well, that you're not the big boss. 78% nitrogen, 21% oxygen, and 1% pollution. That's a, a SpongeBob reference, I, I think, right? Yeah. Where... Where do I go for the, uh, the thing? Peyton, hello. Um, he used to sing it. I did used to sing it, but then it, you know, it's on the radio 7,000 times a day. So why would I sing it? You know, why on earth would I do that? You know, let's go over here. Just see what's up. Cause now it's the boss. So I don't want to talk to you. Um, the menu is reminiscent of Fortnite. In a, in a way, yeah, for sure. Okay. Fix the boombox. You can make Dreadwood sleep so you can sneak in close. Okay. Cool. All right, so it didn't give me an objective marker there, but I knew I had to talk to him anyways. But, you know. Um, radio tower is stirring in the swamp. Play sleepy song over the speakers. Use the boombox there. Uh, now. Okay. Well, if you say so, I will do that. And that, that should give us the means to access the boss door and play that. Cool. So where is the door? The door is way over here. Of course it is. All right. So I'll make my way over there and uh, challenge this big boss. Uh, Amplify saying, don't lean out of frame unprofessional. Oh, sorry about that, man. Sorry about that. Hold on. Let me just... Okay, there we go. No, we're good. Um, if I told you I hate science, would you believe me? Um, maybe. I mean, I don't really like science. I'm not a science guy, you know? See, I can't go over this way. This is dumb. Okay, I can't jump the jump the pond over this way. And I have not seen the uh, Adams Family movie. I, it looked good. 
I, I was very curious, you know, but I did not get a chance to go see it in theaters or see it in general. And as much as my friends love watching animated films with me, uh, they really don't a lot. So they're probably not going to see it. Uh, this game is Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Get noob. So playing this, just wrapping up some of the, uh, the missions that have to be done in here. Uh, we're facing off against a boss momentarily. You get to see the, the action there, and then there'll be a video uh, after the fact. Looks like another cash grab to me. That's a lot of animated films from, like, you know, DreamWorks and all that. It's all the same sort of stuff. But, yeah. I'm just genu- I like, I like the idea of the Addams Family, so that's why I'm low-key hoping it's good. But, you know, you never know. I can't wait for high school chemistry so I can put light, pure oxygen on fire. I've never heard someone say they actually look forward to chemistry. All right, cool. First time for everything, and you're just going to bash me out of the way here. Yep, and you're going to do a lot of damage. Yep, uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, okay, relax. Dandelions, all right, there you go. Done. You prefer the old show? Yeah, I've never watched the old show. I thought it would be good, but hey, you never know. Um... Let's see. Play Lullaby in the radio tower. Oh, okay. So the radio tower is over here. So we play it over here, and then that's what we need to do to access the thing. All righty. Oh, so we have to go up a level. Okay. Now how do I go up the level over here? Probably. Right? Well, let's take care of these just so they don't bother us. There we go. Okay. Oh, just up this way. Cool. Not bad. Uh, cool. You know, the, the thing I love about this game, there's all these, like, super obscure ways to do what you need to do. You know, it's not just walk up and there's a boss and it's done. It's like all these little missions and stuff you have to do, so that's pretty cool. But, uh, now we gotta play those soothing tracks, a.k.a. Uh, Dragon Force. Uh, what's the name of that song from Guitar Hero? Through the Fire and Flames. That's basically what they play into the uh, speakers here. That's going to put you to sleep, right? That's definitely going to put you to sleep. It's going to put me to sleep, man. Definitely going to put me to sleep. Why does this microphone keep moving? Stop moving. Stop it. All right, we're good. There we go. All right, time to infiltrate the area here. Or can we not? Oh, now we can just break it. There we go. For some reason now, they just uh, allow me to go in. And there it is, ladies and gentlemen. The boss door. The final of the four boss doors. The boss gate, I should say. It's going to be a very interesting boss battle. I, um, I think I witnessed a video. I think I know what it is. But I won't spoil it for you for the next 30 seconds. It's going to hopefully be a, an interesting boss. They've all been interesting so far, though. I feel like the first one was definitely the easiest, which makes sense because it's the first one, even though you can technically do all these out of order and do them kind of whenever you want to. Oh, can I really? Oh, it's forcing me to go this way. All right, so I have to time it properly. Okay, so that's a mechanic of probably the, uh, the boss itself is like going and avoiding all the... Uh, the wind that's over here. So just to play it safe, I'm not going to move too far ahead here. Uh, let's see. Do I go over this way? That might be the way to go. Nope, that's not the way to go. All right, let's go over here. Cool. Drop down. I like the movement of this guy too here, you know? Just kind of moves pretty quickly, you know? Okay, this is the heart wood. Okay, the heart of this tree over here. Okay, it's a very big tree. Um, uh, is there... That's water. Okay. Water not necessary here. Uh, what does this do? Uh, okay. Oh, that's what that does. It activates those. Oh, that'll launch me upward. Oh, is that the boss? 
Can I feed him these? No. Okay. Okay. Nope. Don't do that. Okay. Um. Hmm. Oh, on the back here. Okay. There we go. And now direct shots there. Oh, so it's basically going to be me avoiding him spouting me off the edge there. Wow. Okay. Dreadwood, his bark is worse than his bite. Okay. At least I got some decent movement speed here, so that's good. And hopefully avoid all... Oh, I can't avoid all that, seemingly. Okay. All right. So... Okay. Go. Nope. Nope. Avoid. Avoid. Nope. What is happening? What is happening? That's a rapid fire. Rapid fire. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Do I need to avoid all these? Do I need to give into it? I don't know. Uh, let's see here. There's no sort of... Oh, it's his eye. It's his eye. Eye, 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 eye. Okay, eyes. Eyes up. Eyes up. Okay. I thought it might have been a pressure point on the back there, but it's definitely not. Okay. There we go. Let's keep going for that. Nice. Yeah, just totally destroy me. That's fine. That's fine. Get out of here, you. All right. Oh, they break eventually. Noted. They break eventually. Okay. Duly noted. Nope. Okay. Get out of here. Leave me alone. Okay. Nope. What is it going to take for him to stop, I wonder? I don't know, man. But all right. As long as I get him down to a fourth, then I'll be good. Okay, that one broke too. Nice. I wish I had something that did a bit more damage, hopefully. Oh, so there's three pressure points here. Uh, one. Break it, break it, break it. Go. Come on. Oh, there's a certain time limit on it. Okay. I can hear it. One, two, and then three. Give me a second, give me a second, give me a second. Go, 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 go. Come on. There we go. Nice. This thing just doesn't quit, dude. Leave me alone. Get out of here. Okay, don't explode, don't explode. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. Nice. Nope. Oh, yeah, I'm going to die. Give me a second. Give me a second. Let me... Just be here. I'm just going to take it as it comes here. Oh, and I died. Swell. Swell. Oh, boy. Mixer is going to take over YT. I don't know about that, man. We'll see. I don't know. I don't know about that. No. Okay. okay. So, even if you die... It kind of picks up where you left off, which is good. Probably at the end of every phase, it kind of does that. So that's nice. That's actually very, very nice. Oh, you're going to blow this popsicle stand. Go, 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 go. Okay. There we go. Avoid all that. Nice. Give me one shot there. We're good. Okay. Please don't. Okay. Now you're going to... Oh! Okay. Uh, now, let's see. Okay. That's a lot. That's a lot. Faster. Harder, better, faster, stronger. Nah, 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 that they don't kill me. Can only make me stronger. Ah, uh, okay. Never mind. That won't make me stronger. Oh, and there's also little guys down here that also try to kill me at the same time. Isn't that great? Isn't that just awesome? Oh, wow. Yeah, that's a lot. That's... Okay. Sure. Oh, whoa, the car just explodes. That's great, too. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Relax, relax, relax. Do that. Over here. Mm. All right, that's my means to get back up top. Did he regenerate health? I think he did. He might have a little bit. Go up to the top. Thank you, please. All right. Nope. Okay, we're good. As long as I regen a little bit of health here, that's fine. No, I don't think he regen health. Uh, maybe ever so slightly. Okay. Nope. Why is this taking, like, I feel like this is taking a lot longer than normal. Uh, no. Nope. Wait, did I really block him? I really blocked him. Huh, okay, cool. Nice. All right. 
That's my chance to strike. If these things would just leave me alone. Okay. Stop it. And I don't know how they keep lifting me up in the air, too. That's also a thing, but whatever. All right. One, two. One, one, two. Man, I'm really in the zone. Sorry, guys and girls. I'm not even, like, focusing on a topic of conversation or anything like that. Mm, okay. We're good. Good. Is he going to be at half soon? He's at half now. That's great. Okay. Nope. Cool. I just need to not fall off the platform. That seems to be the main thing of concern here, you know? Don't want to have to do that. Go. Nope. Okay, good. All right. All right, he's down to a third. Close enough. Nope. Now all these little ones are going to spawn, too. Avoid it. Hoo! And, uh, hoo! It's like hopscotch, just a lot more deadly. Jump. Jump up, jump up, and get down. Jump, 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 and jump. Okay. All right. That's one weak spot. Done. Well, luckily, these things take me one shot, so that's good. Not uh, too much effort there, but they still kind of sting regardless. Okay. Nope. There we go. Nice. Get these things. Oh, the little acorn buddies, too? That acorn bunny just flew off the edge, actually. Huh. Okay. There we go. Nice. Oh, there were four. I didn't even realize it. Okay. Well, that ended up working out quite a bit. No. No, 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 no. Really? Okay, sure. Well, luckily, there's an activation portal right here. One. No. Avoid it. Avoid it. Go. Yep, that's it. Climb to the skies and the high heavens. We're good. Okay. Oh, no, 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 no. There it is. Nice. I got this, though. I got it. I got it. It's, it takes a little bit of time, but I got it, you know? Okay. Yep, that's it. That's a strategy right there. That's it. Just a little bit of this, a little bit of that, a little meow meow, a little bit of meow meow meow, you know? You know, a little rice pudding never helped, never hurt, I should say. Okay. Dodge that like a boss. Hoppity, whoopty, scoobity. Bibbity bop bop. Bibbity bop bop. One more time. Three more times. Ha cha cha. Hala hala. Okay. Probably five. Yep, there's five of them there. Okay. Alright, and I'm gonna focus on just doing this because there's multiple of them this time. Okay. Oh, yep, there we go. Grab it. There we go. I'm not concerned with you little guys right now. Not concerned. Not concerned. Now I'm concerned. Get out of here, all of you. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. I don't have cover. I don't have cover. That's a bean. How did I dodge that, dude? How on earth did I dodge that? Get this pea shooter out of here. Wow. Wow. Okay. Lots happening here, ladies and gentlemen. Lots happening here. If I keep moving, I'm good. If I keep moving, I'm good. Dodge it like a boss. Go. Okay. Cool. And there are some blockades here, too, so that's good. No. Avoid it. Go. Mm, yeah, there we go. Nice. I think I got it this time. He's going to keep firing some shots, which is fine. Oh, I got it this time. That's it. Done. He's done right here. Not going to blow me off the edge. It's over, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, yeah. Rest in pepperoni, buddy. Oh, he's so sad. Oh, I tried to destroy the zombie, and then, oh, I barfed out marshmallows. And if all trees barfed out marshmallows, I'd probably like trees a little bit more. Oh, and it's a little dummy. Okay, thank you. Rescue the dummy, protector of the dumb. That's what you get for eating, like, plastic. And now the universal zombie hat, as we've seen before. These hats are incredibly disappointing. Uh, level 9 has been achieved, and uh, that's it. The Dreadwood has been defeated. The quest has been completed. There we go, ladies and gentlemen. Excellent. So, now there's a giant dummy restored. And it's, it is what it is. It's all over for now, at least for this section here. So basically, after this all ends here, uh, there's just multiplayer for us to do, which obviously 
doesn't ever end. You can do all sorts of stuff all throughout the multiplayer. But, uh, yeah, that's it for this entire section here. Uh, you earn a, a little metal timber. You earn all sorts of stuff. 25,000 coins. I guess I have marshmallows now that I can transform into stuff, which we can do that in a bunch of different uh, you know, areas as well. So we can find treasure maps or exchange it for gear. I'm probably going to go for the coins just because and do that over and over and over. Well, I can only do it like four times, but still. So I don't care about the other stuff. I don't really have any interest in exploring these areas here. So, you know, um, it's just kind of whatever. So I'll just uh, waste all these here and then find uh, more treasure spots if I wanted to. But yeah, that's it. So I'm going to head back to the main menu and uh, figure out uh, some multiplayer action and whatnot. But uh, that's it for the main campaign areas. So I hope you enjoyed that. And yes, Eli, I was recording. Now I'm not. That's done. So the campaign section is uh, done for Plants vs. Zombies. So it's all going to be uh, online stuff from now on. Thank you guys and girls for bearing with me through that. I should really have another indicator on screen. I'm sorry about that. But, um, you know, it's just a quick thing I wanted to get done. So, yeah, all the campaigns are done. And now multiplayer is basically going to just keep going on and on and on. Uh, at least I don't, um, you know, I'm going to not be garbage at multiplayer, hopefully, for when I actually do do that so i will talk for a few minutes before i bounce out of here the movie starts at 9 30 so i have plenty of time to make it thankfully so um yeah i'll kick it to the cam in the game here just so you know have it not be as much of a focus but hey it's there um don't leave you in the dark uh what did i uh not leave you in the dark about what you know have you seen the new lion king no i have not i've heard it's decent I've heard it's decent. I'm seeing Joker, which I've heard is very interesting. I can't, I'm going to get like a pretzel or something, you know. The reason why they are all third-person shooters, Angel, is because they uh, make money time and time again. So basically, uh, they can add more stuff and monetize more stuff is basically why. Um... You know, it's very easy to add on more content, and the interactivity of the multiplayer stuff really helps with that. Uh, this game actually really flew under the radar with um, the general public, but, I mean, I loved Garden Warfare 2, so I'm liking this so far. The online, I'm trash at. I'm absolutely trash. Um, hey, Brian, you have, you have the dinosaur set? Eli, amazing. Thank you, man. Um, if you get that to me via the P.O. box or however you want to send that, I will send you the money for it. Shipping and all that, too. Just let me know how much it is. But, um, yeah, take your time with it, dude. No rush. Um, I think this is... So, the thing is, Angel, with this game specifically, this is all decked out for Halloween. Now, this is something I've wanted games to do for a long time. I wanted there to be more like okay since it is halloween time in real life why wouldn't it be halloween in the game so now you have all of this like halloween looking stuff all throughout the entirety of the game or at least in this area here it's all decked out this way so for christmas it'll probably be something similar you know thanksgiving who's to say there wouldn't be like fall leaves down here and it updates in real time too so like it'll turn from day to night and all that like there's balloons and stuff it just it looks very festive i love that there's this sort of aspect to the game, you know? I wish more games would do this, honestly. Not many games that they could do it with, but, like, I don't know. And this this area here feels, like, small enough that you can appreciate all the little details and stuff. So I really like this. It's funny how Plants vs. Zombies went from a tower defense to a first-person shooter. Third-person shooter. Uh, first-person is when you have the weapon, like, that's your HUD. This is third-person. Um, I think this is incredibly smart. I love this type of game for and for Plants vs. Zombies it, It's a third-person shooter that isn't bad and has a ton of personality. I really like it. I really really do um, Mad Leroy, hello uh, I'm, You're gonna watch Joker with friends. I won't spoil anything. I don't know anything um, You should live stream you giving candy to kids on the streets and not your apartment well considering that even when I 
like there's no house that I could give out candy at. My grandparents' house, it's all old people that live up there. It's like a retirement place. My, you know, the apartment that I live in, like I'm at home with mom. It's it's a, an apartment. There's no kids in there. They don't go trick or treating there. Um, from the office, no. I'm in like a warehouse building. Um, there's really not a good house. Even like Ricky's house, which is an actual house house in a neighborhood, they don't get many kids. So it's like, you know, it's very disappointing. Um, I should play the classic Doom. Uh, maybe. We'll see. I think it's coming to Switch. So, so Eli, it's $90. What if I give it to you on your Patreon? So 90 months of Tier 1 on Patreon. It's ninety dollars. What if I give you all of it to your Patreon? So ninety. Why would you give me the ninety dollars? No, Eli. I would give you the ninety dollars for the set. Why would you give me ninety dollars? That doesn't make any sense. If you're giving me the dinosaurs, man. But I mean, if you want to give me ninety dollars and the dinosaurs, I highly don't recommend it because that's not smart. But you do if you want with your life, man. You know. Um. The stream is almost out, the reviewer, but that's okay. I'm going to be live streaming Thursday at 1 p.m. for Luigi's Mansion 3. Uh, go Seahawks. Go Patriots, ladies and gentlemen. Um, are you going to stream Mario Maker or Smash Bros. or Mario Kart sometime soon? Uh, maybe next month. We'll see. Why would you? I give you $90 and then you give it back? I will PayPal and an email address $90 as soon as I have the, the dinosaurs and then whatever amount it costs for shipping. Like, even if you don't ship it in the box, you can ship it with whatever, you know? Um, apparently, Pooh Bear's battery is dying, dieting. So, and now we're all getting into an argument about what the uh, best uh, football teams are. So, you know what? I think that really just, ladies and gentlemen, I'm sorry. I think that is a signal for, for me to get out of here. Sorry about that. But it's going to have to be that way. I am going to get out of here. You can all argue about whatever you want to argue about in the comments below. But not not, not on my watch, all right? So, Plants vs. Zombies is done. Again, Thursday, 1 p.m. Eastern Standard Time is when I'm going to be playing Luigi's Mansion 3, recording it at the same time. So, whenever you see the thing in the thing, I'm not going to be looking at the chat. I'm going to be recording for my playthrough basically until I'm exhausted call it a night you know so i want to thank you guys and girls for listening watching tuning in and meowing it out with me as always thank you to kim cw perkins pooh bear dragonite leroy family gaming angel caleb reviewer bricky eli kim and everyone else um it's gonna be a good thursday i'm excited and after luigi's mansion is done say goodbye to the halloween background this very well may be the last normal live stream with this background here. Then, ladies and gentlemen, it's Christmas time. And you may say, Brian, well, Christmas doesn't start until December. Not in this office, ladies and gentlemen. But I uh, hope you all have a fantastic uh, Halloween if I don't see you. But if I do see you on Luigi's Mansion, tune in for that. Otherwise, have a great night. Peace out. Bye.